What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, if you ring the little bell and find my profiles, I super duper appreciate you saying, saying, saying. Um, I got a spirit message in. That's what guided me to do this reading, so I'm going to do it. Um, the message is um, someone is about to receive communication from an official source soon. Um, and I heard some, it will be very positive, some will be very negative. So you take it out, resonates. Um, official source official source so um whatever that is whatever official source that is for you uh i'm thinking some kind of government agency energy government agency energy is what i'm thinking um absolutely uh, it could be an investigator um like a police investigator it could be state police local police child protective services um it could be um um, a higher agency like CIA, oh, if you live in the United States, it would be CIA, um, FBI, um, Department of Homeland Security, possibly. I mean, some kind of um, official, uh, official um, energy of some type. You take it out, resonates. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, that apply. Everyone has free will. I like if the message is resonates. I heard some of these cases, it will be very positive for the person receiving it, receiving the communication, and some it will be very negative. So you take it how it resonates. Spirit, spirit message. Thanks everyone for all the likes, subscribes, and shares. You guys are just at freaking bobdiggity.com. I appreciate each and every one of you guys. I just want to let you know from the bottom of my heart chakra, I really, really do. I appreciate your love and support. If you like to donate, it's PayPal only. The link is in the description box below. No cash app, no Venmo. Someone is extremely strung out on drugs again. Someone is about to do something about this this time. Okay, so you take it out. Resonates. Wow. Heard someone is extremely strung out on drugs again. Someone's about to do something about it this time. We got the bad health card. Um, it could be what the official communication is about. Uh, for some of you guys, I heard some of you guys are going to receive official communication from an official source soon. So for some of you guys, it could be about this person so strung out on drugs so bad because we have the community uh, card and the bad health card. Just saying. Um, that's exactly what I think for some of you guys. Number 39 or 31 might be very significant for someone. 39 or 31. Experiments to just share your questions. Here, messages here as like this. A family is about to get a second chance in a huge, huge, huge way. Huge financial compensation coming soon through many, 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 many series of time events. Huge fresh start. Okay, so that's beautiful. So you take it out, it resonates. I heard a family is about to get, um, I heard a, a second chance, but it's not really a second chance. I mean, I don't think it would be for some of you guys. I mean, for some, it could be um, second chance financially is what it sounds like. Um, I heard a second chance, huge, 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 huge financial compensation um, coming soon. I mean, so it's not a little amount. It's a, it's a lot amount, um, but in you probably went through a hell of a lot to get it, in all fairness, whoever this resonates with. Um, it, I'm sure you did, because you just don't gain a, a hell of a lot of money um, for nothing, um, just saying. 
um, anybody, at least God, I would hope not, but, um, I heard a family, so it's a family, so it's, it's either, um, a single parent or children or a blended family or a, um, family family, like, fam two, um, parents and child or children, take out resonates, but, um, I heard a second chance and a huge, 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 huge financial compensation, um, and a fresh start. So, um, I'm thinking a fresh start financially is exactly what I'm thinking. Um, maybe I think they were stole from thinking they were stole from, or they were frauded or both. I mean, somehow this person that is extremely strung out on drugs is, um, having to do with this in some type of way. Um, check it out resonates. And I think, um, you guys. I think you guys are the community members that are about to report this person that's about to be strong, uh, that is strung, so strung out on drugs. That, uh, like I said, that might be what the official communication is about for some. Spirit messages you have reflected. That's really, I just want to say that's truly, truly sad that somebody wastes their life. Um, being strung out on drugs, it really, really is. It's it's a life wasted. It's a life taken too soon. It's really sad. We got courtship and thief. So I'm thinking the person uh, we've got. Um, the person that was strung out on drugs, it sounds like they were in a relationship with somebody, but only in a relationship with them to take their money because we have thief up right. So, um, either in a relationship with them or, um, like in the secret seven situation, um, where the family, um, the single mom, Leo's toxic family, uh, implanted that, um, listening device or, hidden monitoring system or something like of that nature in her home camera or something of that nature. Um, basically just to spy on her when she really wasn't in a relationship, but she, um, was basically being voyeured out to everybody and their mama. Um, and it was making, um, these people money. Um, you plug it in how it resonates for some of you guys, you could have actually physically been in a relationship, um, with this person, like, like in the 3D physically in a relationship with this person. Um, and they were strictly in this relationship with you only came around for the money, um, for some, you plug it in, how it resonates. Um, but however that resonates, whether it's a secret seven situation or you were physically in a relationship, like in the 3D with this uh, relationship with this person and they just was around basically to steal your money. Um, I think this person that was just around to steal your money, um, if it is a three just a three D relationship, um, they're in severe bad health because they're severely strung out on drugs. And I think uh, community members are about to really step up and do something about it now. I heard they didn't do it in the past, but they're about to now. So um, that's that's awesome. And it sounds like this person that was stole from, at least for one of these situations, um, the person that was stole from in this situation, whether it was a secret seven situation or a physical 3D relationship where you actually allow this person in your home um, and was around you and your kids, um, if you have kids, um, it sounds like you're about to get a very a fresh start. And that might be where the official communication from official sources come in as well. Because I heard very, 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 very large um, financial compensation. That's at least for one of you guys. Um, you take it out resonates. Spirit messages you have look like this. Lots of secret children have been born from the secret seven situation. And some, some currently in womb. 
Okay. Oh my God. Whoa. Okay. So I heard secret seven in here. So, um, for some, you know, if you plug in with the secret seven situation, you plug it in your life, how it fits. If not, you plug it in, how it fits in your regular life. If you're physically in 3d, with this person, um, because in the secret seven situation, single mom Leo was not, she was not around that person in the physical 3d. Um, she wasn't around any, she didn't have men coming up in her house. She didn't. Um, it was that damn hidden camera, hidden boyer camera or hidden monitoring system or whatever the hell that was, um, that was stuck up in her home, um, that was making the money. So it's not the fact she was bringing men around home. Um, if that makes sense. Um, but I heard, um, basically, um, the many children have been born from the, um, secret seven situation, secret children. Um, already and some currently in womb so some people are pregnant from pe members of the secret seven that could be core members or feeders you take it out resonation i just heard secret seven situation so um it could be core members or it could be feeders but there was so many people <laughs> in the, the feeders that that oh that really doesn't narrow it down but I heard secret seven situation. So I heard lots of secret children have been born. So lots of secret children have been born for the secret seven situation. Lots. So whether it was a feeder through the camera or um, a core member of the secret seven. And I heard some currently in womb. So some people are pregnant with people that were connected with the secret seven right now. Currently. Um, and some have children by the people um, of the secret seven. Wow. Spirit messages you have reflected. Your messages you have reflected. Spare messages you have reflected. Spare messages you have reflected. This family that's giving a fresh start is going to be given a fresh start. It's going to be the best thing that ever happened to them on many levels. The financial fresh start. Okay, I heard the family that's about to be given the financial fresh start. There's one particular family in here that's about to be given a financial fresh start. I heard another one. Um... I heard it's going to be the best thing that ever happened to them um, financially. So um, whatever family this is resonating with, that's about to get this um, wonderful financial fresh start. Um, I'll, t uh, I'll tell you this, whoever this is, um, whether it's one, you know, a single parent and kids or two parents and kids, they're very good with money. I'll tell you that they're very, they're very good with money. I'm sure they are. I'm sure they'll invest in stocks and bonds and um really like pay off all their debts and um invest in stocks and bonds and really really um uh, grow their financial future really grow it not you know um not um blow it all on gambling or blow it all on sex addictions or blow it all on drugs or blow it all on fancy wancy vacations which vacations are nice but it's planning it in a very um, conscientious financial sense. Um, absolutely. So um, I, I guess what I'm trying to say with that is the family that's about to receive this um, wonderful financial, um, large financial blessing, basically, um, through this. And I think it might be through the government, possibly. I do. I think for some of you guys, I think it is. Um, I do. I do for some of you guys. Um, 
but you take it out resonates. But I heard um, basically um, it's going to, uh, I think you're going to be very financially conscientious, very financially conscientious. You'll really, um, you'll really, um, you'll really watch your money. You'll watch it even if you, I mean, it sounds like you'll have a lot of it, but you'll really invest it well. You'll invest it well. I have some freaking loot. Spirit messages you have for companies. And yeah, I mean, if that was me and that was the case for me and that happened to me, you better believe I'd be stocks and bonds in it and really, um, um, you know, paying off everything I need to pay off and getting everything fixed I need to get fixed and, you know, taking care of the important stuff first. Absolutely, you know, absolutely. Very significant communication is about to come in to a Leo soon. Very significant. Very real. And very straightforward. Very honest. Okay, so you take it out resonates. I heard very significant communication is about to come into a particular Leo soon. Very real, very straightforward, and very honest. So um, we're drawing Leo energy in here. Now, for some, you know, I did hear Secret 7 in here. So for some, it could be Secret 7 Leo. Or um, if you are if you do not plug into the uh, Secret 7 situation, you plug yourself in how you fit in here, if you do. Um, but I heard a... Um, a, a, a Leo, a significant Leo. I mean, I'm sorry. uh a Leo is about to receive very significant communication soon. Um, very honest, straightforward, and real. Um, so significant communication to a Leo. They could have Leo in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or Femme, Midheaven, or Jupiter. It could be masculine or femme. You take out resonates. Could be Leo the secret seven, or you plug yourself in how it fits, if it does fit with you. Um, but I heard it's going to be very honest, real, and straightforward. So um, it's going to be, you know, no lies, no manipulation. Um, none of that BS, basically. Um, it's obviously not the person strung out on drugs. Um, obviously, because the person strung out on drugs probably is so out of their damn mind. They probably won't be able to carry forth a, um, legible sentence, um, or legible, um, thoughts, you know, probably like word salad, um, probably for some, um, would be my guess because when I worked at the jail, um, sometimes when people came in really, really hopped up on drugs, it was really, really hard sometimes to understand what they were saying. So that's why I say that. Um, and I heard this person is currently struggling out of drugs. So I mean, and bad. So it's not, you know, it's not they just slipped up and shot up or snored up or smoked up or whatever they do. Um, it's, it's bad. It's bad. Um, apparently they've been doing a hot minute. Okay. A particular feminine mother figure is about to have the police call on her very, very soon. Abuser to her child. Some adult children, some minor children. Okay, so you take it out resonates. Okay, so well, that's two or more. That's two or more. So we have a, a, a particular adult femme energy. So adult femme mother figure. Now mother figure, that could be a guardian, that could be a foster parent, that could be a, a true blood parent. You take it out resonates, but I heard a mother figure. So either, like I said, a guardian or a um, foster parent or a true blood parent mother figure but however that resonates i heard um so, um it sounds like 
it's two or more mother figures, but they're about to get the police called on them soon um, because I heard abuse of their child. But some of their children they're abusing is actually an adult they have abused or is currently abusing. And some, it is a um, an actual child. Uh, so a minor child, um, below 18 years old child they are currently or ha has abused. And it's a um, feminine... Um, Mother figure. 40 and above. 40 and above is what I just heard. 40 and above. So a feminine mother figure, 40 and above. Like I said, it could be guardian, has guardian rights currently, foster mother, or um, legal, I meant blood mother. Um, you take it out, resonates. Man. But I heard they're about to get the police called on them. They're about to get the police called on them. Definitely jail and other negative series of chain events. Caused a huge mess in a community. Huge. Okay. I heard um, definitely jail. Definitely jail. Possibly prison. Um, I heard they created a huge mess in a community. Uh, so these, uh, it's at least two or more um, feminine, 40 and above mother figures. Mother figures. The masculine upright, will upright, nourishment upright. I heard a particular Leo is about to receive um, very significant communication from a particular um, person. It could be the official person um, that's going to bring communication in or not. You take it out, resonates. But um, um, very significant communication, very real, honest, and straightforward. So I do feel for some of these Leos, it is um, from that government, uh, not government, I'm sorry, agency, um, official agency energy, basically. It, I strongly feel for some of you guys, it is the government. It is. I do feel that. But, you know, you take it out, resonates. But um it's very honest straightforward and real i'll tell you that whatever the communication is whether it's not from an official um uh person like you know um agency energy or um police or investigators or something like that if it's not that um it's um honest straightforward and real communication so you take it out resonates Lots of communication energy in here. Lots of communication energy about someone being struck out of drugs, about someone being in a very toxic relationship, whether it's you, they were actually in the 3D relationship together or it was a single mom Leo situation where it was the funky voyeur um, undercover um, wiretapping shit that shouldn't have been in there, basically. Um, you take it out resonates. The masculine upright, will upright, nourishment upright. A particular masculine energy has lots of desire, drive, and motivation now to really, really help this family. Really, really help them. Definite soulmate energy. They truly, truly, truly see the real truth. Truly do now. Okay. So you take it out, resonates. I heard a particular masculine energy. This is this is great. I heard a particular masculine energy has lots of desire, drive, and will and motivation, basically. So lots of fire sign energy, lots of will. Um energy to really help this family um now because i heard they truly see the real 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 truth now so the real black and white truth the real truth not lies not slander not gossip not gossipy gales and gossipy gary's not people that are jelly in their jammies um <clears throat> just talking shit you know because you could talk somebody down all day long for strategic reasons um but like i'm thinking this person might be um, an investigator. This person might be an investigator or in some kind of agency energy or they just are able, maybe they're around this um, family. Maybe they're a neighbor. Maybe they're a neighbor and they really see the real truth. Um, you take it out resonates, but somehow they're 
able to see this family. They're able to see this family and they're able to really see the real truth. And I don't think it's just the family. I think it's the whole thing they're able to see. I think it's the family they're able to see and the whole stealing from this family situation. This person being completely strung out on drugs, this person that either was physically in a, a relationship with this person, Leo or not, or single mom Leo situation where that this per, um, someone claimed to be in a relationship with single mom Leo, but they never were. They never were because nobody was around in single mom Leo's house because she wouldn't allow it. So, um, you know, so whether it was false or not, like double life or not, you know, you take it out resonates. But I heard this masculine energy has lots of desire, drive, and motivation to really help this uh, family now um, because they see the real truth. But I think it's the entire truth is what I'm trying to say. I think it's um, this person strung out on drugs. I think it's the lack of support for the um, family situation. I think it's the whole stealing situation. I think it's the entire shebang is what I'm trying to say. Um, that's exactly what I think. The, the big the bigger picture the whole perspective of things um, not just one particular aspect um, of this so he wants he has lots of desire drive will and motivation to really help his family now and nourishment upright I heard he's soulmate energy to this uh, family or he's going to be soulmate energy to this family so um, I think the nourishment card here is really um, him helping um, get this family the justice they deserve, basically. Um, he's nourishing their, um, he's nourishing them. Um, I think financially, for at least one particular situation in here, I think it's financially getting the money back that was stole from them. That's exactly what I think. Um, so he's going to help nourish them financially. And of course, you know, if this family is good with money, which I feel, I strongly feel in here, they would be. Um, I, I really do because they've experienced such huge um, thievery. I'm sure they know how to manage their money because they've been stole from so badly. They've had to basically work with what the hell they've had to have. You know, um, the little that they've had, they've had to work with. So I'm sure, you know, um, if you're able to work with a little bit, you're able to work with a lot in the financial sense is what I'm trying to say. Um, because um, if you're able to work with a little bit, if you had addictions like severe addictions like drug addictions or gambling addictions or something like that, your money would be gone in a New York minute. You'd be out there getting quick, fast loans. You'd be out there selling your body for um, money or, or um, you know, selling yourself to the streets or some kind of crazy shit like that um and i'm not saying i don't feel this family is doing that at all at all i think it's very opposite but what i'm saying is this family was forced to be good with money they were forced to be with good, good with money because they didn't have much money because they were being stole from so damn bad so that that's what i mean on that um, because if this family had such bad addictions like drug addictions or alcohol addictions or gambling or sex addictions the um, head, either one um, parent or both parents would be broke as jokes. Um, you see what I'm saying? But it, I mean, it doesn't seem like it. It seems like they're handling what they have right now well financially. It's not a lot, but what they have, they're handling well, if that makes sense. Because they've experienced such horrible thief energy. Um, so they've, uh, they've had to do it, basically. Um, so I think the nourishment upright here is basically really bringing life into this family and really helping this family. Um, I heard a fresh start, a fresh start. So they'll have a, a whole new fresh start. Now it might be in a different location. It might be, um, I'm thinking for some, it might be in a different location. I do. Um, especially if it's that secret seven situation, that community is the one that basically drug um, that poor family into the ground. They drug them into the ground. Um, now, of course, they're not doing it no more. They're not doing it anymore. But it went on for like almost two years. Um, it went on for such a long time that, um, you know, it's not going on anymore. But that that single mom Leo knows it happened. Um, she knows it happened. So, you know, yeah, it's not going on anymore. But, you know, you can't change memories. 
you know i mean that's just the truth but um i think he's going to help bring life to this situation um i think it's going to help bring life either i think through government um maybe through the government or through huge grants or donations or something um financially and and other ways and other ways okay i heard in other ways in other ways He knows honesty is key in this, and he is very right. Okay, I heard, I heard he knows honesty is key in this, and he's very right. So this masculine energy um, that's about to help the situation in a huge way, this family, I heard he knows honesty is key in this, and he's very right. So um, you take it how it resonates. This is pretty beautiful. Uh, let me see if I hear anything else. Okay, I didn't. I didn't. All right, personal readings currently closed. However, donations, um, super duper greatly appreciated. I don't. I don't do personal readings. I don't do personal readings. Um, I don't. But if you like to donate, it's PayPal only. I don't do Cash App. I don't do Venmo. Um, it's PayPal only. Um, and that's it. Oh, and if you see my face anywhere on any other Facebook channel, I'm not, not Facebook, YouTube channel, anywhere, claiming they're me, Mary Diane Smith or Mary Johnson Smith. Mary Johnson Smith is my Facebook handle. Mary Diane Smith is my legal name. Please report them to for, to YouTube for fraud. I've had another chick, um, some very strange events happening with another chick. Uh, the past three weeks, I've never met this chick, but long story short, she's been Facebook stalking me for about three weeks now. And then all of a sudden now, yesterday I found out she has my last name on her Facebook page. Um, but her current girlfriend, that's not her last name. Um, my last name is Smith. She has Smith on her Facebook, but that's not her last name. So I, I that's not her girlfriend's last name. So I, I don't know what's going on with that. But um, if she is on another channel anywhere on the internet and she's claiming she's me, Mary Diane Smith, um, I don't know why the God she has Smith on her last name. But um, uh, please report her for fraud for YouTube if she claims she's me, Mary Diane Smith. She has different, uh, she has, I have this tattoo on my left wrist. That's the only one I have, but she has different tattoo placements on her. And, and she, but she looks just like me in the face. That's how you'd be able to differentiate her. Her initials are A, B, A is in Apple, B is in boy. So I'm um, just throwing that out there if anybody um, um, has sees that anywhere, particularly like on a twin flame channel um, with another masculine energy, just saying. All right, I love you guys so much. Everybody make wonderful choices and I'm gonna stay.